up guys, it's Josh and we're back again with another video. Like I said last time, this is gonna be another video where I let you guys in on some of the stuff that has been happening to me here at Yale over the last few weeks. If you're new to the channel, I'm Josh and I'll be using this YouTube channel to chronicle my life at Yale as well as give you guys some tips to get into your own dream school. If that sounds interesting or appealing, consider subscribing. Also, if you missed last video, I now have a PO box here at Yale. So if you wanna send me any letters, mail, Swedish fish, um, send them to this address right here. I'll also leave it in the description down below. Okay, like you guys probably saw in the title, the topic of today's video is my first day of classes here at Yale. Although I did tell you guys what classes I was actually taking a couple videos ago, uh, I'll quickly go over what my actual schedule is throughout the week. So on Mondays and Wednesdays, my first class is English, which starts at 11, and then I have physics immediately afterwards. This is good because all my classes are kind of compacted in one little time area, but that also means I have 10 minutes between English and physics. English is in the very back of old campus, and physics is at the Sloan Physics Laboratory at the top of Science Hill, which is about as far as two classes could possibly be at Yale and I only have 10 minutes to get between them. It is quite a trek, but I only have to do it twice a week, which is good. On Tuesdays, I have uh, Air Force ROTC physical training at like six in the morning. Then I get back from that, I have enough time to eat breakfast and shower, and then I have to head straight off to my computer science section, which starts at like 9.20, I think. After computer science, I head straight to math and finish up math around 12.50, and I'm done for the day. On Thursdays, I have ROTC all the way from six till about 10.30. I have enough time to grab a quick snack in the dining hall and then I have math again at 11 and I finish up around 12.50 again on Thursdays too. Luckily I plan my schedule so that I do not have any classes on Friday. So I could take a three day weekend if I wanted to. Honestly, I'm kind of low key proud of my schedule. I only have classes four days a week and two of the days I get to sleep until 11 if I want to. Like my blue booking skills are on point. All right, so the first day of classes was actually on a Wednesday, which meant that I had English and physics. I got to sleep in late and still had enough time to go hit the TD gym down in the basement. Um, after that, I went and grabbed a bagel and a couple hard boiled eggs from the dining hall and started walking over to old campus for English. I really did enjoy my first English class. It's seminar style, which means it's there's only like 15 kids in our class. And the class consists of basically open conversation about whatever essay we're reading for the whole time. The professor is a grad student who has a lot of energy and passion for what we're doing. And she really wants to make us the best routers we can possibly be. After English ended, I hit that light jog all the way up Science Hill and managed to get to physics just in time. But I was like dripping in sweat and breathing really hard. But, but it's all good, it's all good. Unlike my English class, Physics is taught in a lecture style. It's not a huge lecture. It's not like intro econ, which is like 450 kids. It's it's sitting at about 150 people, I would say. It works out because like even in the very back row, you can still see her notes on the chalkboard. Right from the first day of physics though, we got our first problem set assigned. And it definitely was not easy. I mean, I've taken two years of physics in high school, but this problem set was like, she took all the super hard problems at the end of each section and just put them all together in one homework assignment. It's all good though, I, I like a challenge. Physics ended around 2.30 and I was done for the day. It was definitely one of my shorter days, but it was fun and I could definitely tell that I'd be learning a lot. After class finished, I took a couple hours to start working on the physics and English assignments that I got assigned. Um, I grabbed dinner with some friends and then we hung out down in the uh, basement by the buttery and played ping pong for a couple hours. It was a pretty good day, pretty good first day. All right, that's it. Um, that pretty much sums up my first day of classes here at Yale. Uh, Sorry I couldn't actually film anything the day of, but I'm glad I still got to share with you guys how it went. If you guys have any questions about my classes or Yale in general, just leave a comment down below, I'll try to answer it. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like, hit that big red subscribe button to support more content from me in the future. As always, I'll be back again in a couple days with another video. See you soon.